We're slowing it down for a fitness workout this morning. Uh, Kaleen Diyakhe is a yoga fitness instructor, and she's here to teach us some extensive stretching and breathing techniques and exercises. Yoga is for everyone, and that's the nice thing about it, is that you can create some space anywhere you are and get on with it. So join us this morning. Let's do it. Kaleen, what have you got in store for us this morning? Okay, so I know this is your first time it's doing yoga, time. so I'll be easy on you. <laughs> yeah. Okay, we're going to start uh, in a mountain pose. I'm going to teach you a vinyasa-style yoga. Um, that's my favorite style to teach. It's vinyasa. Like, yeah, it is a movement link with breath, okay. and it can be really flowy, like almost dance-like. Mm. Uh, your, your heart rate goes up, and you get quite a workout. Okay, everybody likes to dance, so let's do that. Yes, of okay. course. Okay. okay, so we'll start in a mountain pose with your feet parallel. Mm -hmm. You can maybe bring your hands to your heart. And then breathe in, reach arms all the way up into a mountain pose, reaching, lengthening your spine. And then exhale, bend your knees to forward fold. You can bring your fingertips to the floor, bend your knees a little bit more, relax. <laughs> this is head. a lot of fun. <laughs> Shake the hips. Wiggle. <laughs> then place your hands down, bend mm -hmm. your knees, and slowly step into a plank. Okay, right. plank is nice and strong. Tuck your tailbone under. Mm -hmm. And then shift your weight forward over, over, over your wrists, yeah. bend your elbows, slowly mm -hmm. lower into a push up. Okay. Now come into an up dog, press your tops of your feet down. And then press your hands into the floor, feet onto the floor, yeah. and then lift and open up the front of your body. Oh. And then you can tuck your chin, lift your hips, come to a down dog. We just practice that. Uh -huh. um, push your sit bones up to the ceiling, heels yeah. back and down. And I need to relax yes, your neck. And this really does help you with your breathing because you, you start to feel that there's a bit of a overflow of air, right? Yeah, so what we do in vinyasa is you link one movement with one breath. So you, for example, inhale, lift your leg. Yeah. Then you exhale, step your left foot through. <laughs> and then you come up into a lunge, inhale, reaching arms up. <laughs> and exhale, bring your hands to your heart. Uh -huh. Just want to... Oh, you need okay. some help with your mind. No worries. <laughs> Hands to your heart. Yeah. Okay, then we inhale, reach arms forward. Mm. Open up your arms, warrior two. Drop your back heel. Look over your front fingertips like a warrior. <laughs> Beautiful. <laughs> like and a warrior. Then we're going into a flying warrior. Right. So drop your right hand down. Mm. Shift your weight into your front foot. And slowly lift, reach like you're flying <sighs> through the sky. Okay, it's not as easy as it seems. No, you make it look all so easy. But the nice thing is I've got you here yeah, all morning. Sure. We're going to be back with part two of a <laughs> yoga training session. Thank you. I'm out of breath well. there for that. <laughs> so stay with us, okay? Thank you. It's my feel good breakfast show. We're back for our fitness session with yoga teacher Galeen <laughs> Diyahe this morning. Lots of fun, lots of stretching and lots of blood flowing through our bodies. Okay, so we're going to do the next set of things here. Um, and, but the first thing that I wanted to find out is, you know, a lot of guys are intimidated by yoga. I mean, I know a lot of my friends watching now have been texting me, watching the show, are telling me, okay, not sure why you're doing that <laughs> particular fitness thing. But what, what, is it a guy's thing? Is it a girl's thing? How does this work? Anybody who has a body can do yoga. I know a lot of guys are <laughs> very intimidated. Yeah. Uh, to show up at a yoga studio, they yeah. think that they won't be able to get into all the poses. Yeah. But you don't need to be flexible to do yoga. Yeah. You don't need to be female either. Because you gain flexibility in the yoga. Yes, let's the flexibility will come. Okay, yes. let's get flexible. Okay, so let's start in the tree pose, okay. like we discussed. So we're going to start with our foot right on the inner thigh. Mm -hmm. And this is such a nice pose, everybody always loves this. So this really tests your balance yeah. and also mental focus. So you want to focus on something <laughs> okay, yeah, to sorry. get your energy. But yeah. now we're going to, from here, see if we can keep the balance and step back into a lunge. So we're going to step all the way back as far as you can, mm -hmm. then maybe shuffle the toes further. Yeah. Lift your chest up, come into a high lunge, reach your arms up, lift up through your fingertips. Yeah. That's it. And then we're going to go into that warrior two that we did earlier. So we're gonna open up, gaze over your front fingers, palms down. So we're gonna do that flow that I was talking about. Lift your palm up, reach your right hand back, left arm up and over. Then slowly bring your left forearm to your left thigh. Keep the left leg bent. Sweep your right arm down, open up your chest. That's it, hold. Loving it. And uh, come back to a warrior two. <laughs> yeah. 
And then we go back to our flying warrior that we did earlier. Come around, reach up and lift. Then bend your left knee, bring your right knee to your chest and slowly come up again, balancing. Then maybe place your right ankle on top of your left thigh. Come to sit down, number four, squat mm -hmm. and hold. That's it, flex the toes, very good. <laughs> and slowly bring that right knee back up. Maybe bring arms up. And this is where the balance wow, comes in. Wow, okay. So, yeah. I need to definitely work on my balance a little bit more. It um, comes with time. One other tip to give to anyone looking to start yoga today. I'd say stop doubting yourself. Everybody yeah. can do yoga. Yeah. Um, maybe get yourself a yoga DVD or a yoga book mm. and start a home practice. It's easy to feel intimidated to go to a studio. Yeah. Maybe start at home and then get comfortable and then get yourself a nice studio. Yeah, I'm really enjoying this. It's really good for toning. It's really good for blood circulation, mental um, stimulation yeah. and all, all of that. Thank you so much for joining Thank us this you. morning. You've really got well. me working out a sweat. Awesome. Stay with Thank us. You. It's your feel-good breakfast, your espresso.